Que onda? What's up, YouTube? It is Scripps back in the mix with a new video. It has been a minute since I've uploaded some sports content. Almost a month, I think. Now, the last video I uploaded was for the hero content, which I'll be putting up uh, cards on the short time feed very, very shortly. Uh, but for today's video, we just have a little personal rip um, that was it was secured um, by the homie, the OG, uh, the GOAT, John P. Um, now, those who know, those who don't know, uh, Walmart in, uh, I, think, I, don't, I think it was just Walmart, was uh, dropped some of this uh, mosaic this past week, this past, um, was it Friday, I believe it was? And to, to much people's chagrin, they didn't even know that that was going to happen. Everybody's waiting for Prism, which I'll, I'll touch on in a minute. But everybody's, you know, waiting for that. And they're looking, you know, what's going to be restocked, what's going to be restocked. Hopefully, Prism will be restocked. This past Friday, it wasn't. But everybody woke up to this, Blasters and Cellos. Now, at my, uh, at my, um, what, what, what can we call it? When I went to Walmart... It wasn't. It was. It was already set up, but I was running so so short on time, and I forgot. Uh, for one, my phone, and two, my wallet in the car. All I had was some. Uh, I think it was like ten dollars in my pocket, and I was just in there to get something to drink, and maybe get a snack. But the lady had done, just got done uh, putting up the stock, and a whole sleeve, a whole sleeve of these, was right there, and my Dumas. Uh, forgot to take anything with me so I could just run in there real quick not even thinking about it but like I said the goat John came through uh, he clutched it out and he was able to uh, procure some cellos and a blaster for me uh, so I can rip on the channel here um, but the main reason why I'm, I'm in touch and base with y'all and making the video today uh, for one just want to do a little personal rip hopefully we can you know it's been a while, so, you know, obviously the itch has been there for me as well as for other people. Uh, number two, talk about PRISM, right? Uh, it's been on everybody's radar for because it's been, you know, delayed, 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 delayed for months and months on end. Um, but it's finally coming to uh, retail shelves most likely this week, I believe, on the 17th, if I'm not mistaken. We're hoping Target Online will drop. Um, bots are going to eat it up, but my, uh, people on Twitter have hinted that, uh, Prism, like Mosaic, is so overproduced that even if the bots cook, people that, you know, just want to buy, if they get in on it early, we'll be able to get some, uh, I believe blasters, megas, and cellos that are going to be dropping on, on, on Target's website. I just don't know when. Because Target has been so erratic and, and, and downright trollish lately. Um, they've been, you know, people have been uh, watching to see if they're going to be dropping something overnight. And they do, but they just drop, like, baseball, college prism, and, and college prism basketball. So they've, they've been trolling pretty hard. And it, they've been getting their point across, you know what I'm saying? So it is what it is. But for sure, we believe uh, Walmart will drop uh, retail prism this week. So be on the lookout for that. Um, it's going to be rough. A lot of people have been waiting on it. So, you know, if, if you're in there in line and hopefully they got some limitations on how many people, how many products people can buy at a given time, because you never know, somebody might just swoop it all up. Um, but yeah, so yeah, I basically just want to touch base with you guys, let you know what's happening. For me, i just been working, spending time with the family, you know, gearing up for summer, summer vacay. And honestly, I just didn't want to put out a uh, product or put out content really about product I wasn't passionate about, you know, it was a lot of, you know, junk wax out there and there, there's plenty and they're sitting on the shelves. And I mean, sitting, they were put out a week ago and the same stuff has been there for a couple weeks now. You know, I love baseball, but you know, on this channel, baseball doesn't, you know, really get any traction. So I'm not going to give you guys what y'all don't want. You know, I mean, I, so for, for me, I'm mostly, um, passionate about football and and uh and um come see my uh hro and uh, Fortnite. but of course you know when basketball re-ups again i'm gonna get back into that get back to the swing of things but you know this is this is the bread and butter so to speak in terms of my my interest but uh so you know without too much japan and john and of course just like always 
I'll put a timestamp that everybody can skip all the rambling and my reintroduction so they can get straight to the, the, the reps here. Um, so, you know, without further ado, what I'm going to do is I'm going to just pause real quick. I'm going to undo this blaster and these four cellos and just see, you know, have a little fun rip, see what we can find. No big deal, no stress, no whatever, you know. It is what it is. So I'll be right back in just a second. All right, mi gente, we're back. Uh, so to my left here, we have uh, four cellos and the bonus, uh, I believe it was what, pink camel packs. Um, pink parallels, I believe. It's been a while since I ripped any kind of uh, cellos, but it, this is a, I gotta say, these right here are a side for sore eyes. Um, without, you know, being on the camera, without streaming or putting them up on the channel, I ripped a few packs of just randomness and compared, it's weird because I used to, not see y'all, but you know, to myself, I complain when you don't hit something on these and, and when you when you rip or get into any other uh, product, you really appreciate this uh, this run of mosaic because these are absolutely loaded in just by comparison to what's out there. Um, so you know these <laughs> it's it's these these are aside for stars even if we don't really get anything uh, to be honest with you. So what I'm gonna do real quick I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna start with these uh, blaster the, the blaster packs here and go from there. Yeah. See if I still got it. One the luck and two the uh, the sausage fingers have been a bit dusty, a bit rusty, so we'll see if I can get anything here. Okay. Got a silver over there. Let's see, we'll see what that's, what that's going to be. We got a uh, Super Bowl MVP, Von Miller. A rookie silver, Caleb Farley. And a rookie, uh, Z's Jolari. Uh, okay, yeah, yeah, cool, cool, being cool. Is the variation I'm hoping for? N nope, that's all good. It's a rookie and it's a silver. Can't be too mad at it. But, um, like I was saying about Prism, you know, um, the, I believe for the, um, the checklist there's not gonna be any autos in the Walmart in uh, cellos and hangers they're not gonna have any autos I believe Target has either auto or mem that's gonna be involved with that one and this in the blasters gonna have a checkered the chasers are gonna be checkered uh, parallels and I believe the the hangers are gonna have the silver variations and the cellos are gonna have that red white and blue um, parallel. So I'm thinking that uh, that Mac Jones with the Patriots color is going to be uh, mighty sought after on that one. And you got to forgive me again. I still got this uh, setup over here where it's so wonky. It's hard to uh, to do this. I wonder if I can zoom in a little bit. Yeah, that might be help though. All right, we got a Jarvis Landry. And his buddy there, yeah, right. <laughs> um, it's crazy because um, green mosaic, right? I'm telling you, it's been so long. I'm forgetting the names of these things, and I've been trying to figure out what I'm gonna put up next. If we're gonna put up like shoe restoration content, you know, my hats, my kicks, or you know, and I've been putting a little shorts, the the short videos on my channel about the restorations I've been doing, which has been fun, you know. But and I really want to be, get back into the you know pack ripping, back into the hobby. So hopefully with the release of Prism, we're gonna do some good things. Catch some some luck, some fuego. Okay, we got Andre Reed with the Hall of Fame uh, Prism, and the the true rookie Travis Etienne Jr. I don't think I've pulled this one. The true rookie. That is definitely welcome. And again, forgive me, I gotta get back to the swing of things. I lost my speed. It's been a minute. I was getting used to those hero packs there. I mean, they rip like 
top tops packs very easy to, to get open for the most part yeah we got a two uh see there you go that's the one i'm used to right there nfl debut we got another afc compadre dago oval oh oh day man okay you you know okay you're good right here bro you're good and we got a billy sims Man, see, I'm over here losing. I'm over here looking at those. Man. You know who else is looking at them? Leo back there. Leo's looking at them. I'm trying to get, uh, trying to collect those little Ninja Turtle bag clip things because I want to put them over here. A little backdrop. Russell Wilson, Antonio Gibson, Randy Moss, and another whomever rookie yeah prism i'm hearing you know like you i'm sure everybody that's you know watching this and waiting for prism to come out, watch those videos on those hobby boxes and the first off the lines and there was a lot a lot a lot of dusty boxes out there man and i gotta tell you the thought crossed my mind i mean i, I mean I, there's no way i was going to convince my wife but uh, there's the thought crossed my mind if i was going to get in on that first off the line to see if i can put in with like a me and a buddy of mine but after seeing watch probably what like 10 10 videos 11 videos like eight out of those 11 videos have been just disastrous i mean just so disheartening i couldn't imagine taking an l after putting in essentially what 1100 dollars if i was going to get a first off the line 11 1200 dollars on my my half a ain't no way ain't no way boy if i took an l like that So, so essentially, is that I'm, I'm glad I didn't I didn't risk it for that kind of a biscuit because it would have been a dry, dusty Popeyes biscuit. No offense to anybody like Popeyes, I'm just saying you know they get, they got dry biscuits out there. Okay, we got a Rodney Harrison, Kurt Warner, Man of the Year, Buddha, Buddha Baker, and DJ Moore. No rookie in that pack, but it's cool. It's cool. But yeah, Prism, uh, the retail man. People people are worried about it. People I've heard of. Now, worried is a misrepresentation. <clears throat> the way the way they were talking about it, they were, they were talking about that uh, Panini's kind of forcing your hand to buy hobby because all the the, the the best parallels are in hobby, whereas in in retail prism, you you know you're gonna get the bottom of the barrel in comparison to what was available first off the line in the hobby, whereas mosaic. You had a chance to get case hits, Genesis, Scripps, um, what is that, Stained Glass, all these dope-ass parallels that were available to us in Retail Mosaic would not be re available to us in Retail Prism. And what that tells me is that because the, and in addition to that, because of the checklist, I believe is over 400 and in that, that kind of size, and you got all these random people that's in this checklist. Mar St. Brown there. Uh, it's going to, you know, dilute a lot of the, the value, except for those Mac Jones, Trevor Lawrence, you know, um, see, I'm over here forgetting, you know, uh, Jamar Chase, et cetera, et cetera. You know what I mean? So if you get a silver variation or a silver prism, brother, uh, and you know, for one of those guys, those are going to be uh, the their, their value is going to you know either hold steady or go up because the checklist is so big, so it's going to be harder to get them. Which I've heard it, in every year, it's harder to to hit just a a basic prism of a, a highly sought after guy. So, but again, prism year after year has been the top dog in terms of retail, aside from. Um, you know what is it optic and uh, select which i'm personally looking forward to they just it looks so clean man and the colors it i i for one am looking forward to select more than i am to prism but you know anything i can get my hands on in terms of uh, ripping and seeing if we can pull a banger especially for the channel especially so i can share that with you guys i'm gonna try to but you know i just can't just break the bank for the sake of just breaking the bank it's got to be calculated now as we go along and if we grow as a channel and that kind of thing then of course you know i'm gonna be able to be 
comfortable on just, you know, risking it for other stuff. You know what I'm saying. I'm not, I ain't got to tell you all about it. Majority of people watching this, they got bills of their own. They know what I'm talking about. Okay, so yeah, now we're moving on to the four solo packs. First things first, we're going to go to the uh, the bonus packs here and see if we can get a rookie. Probably not, but okay. It's okay if we don't. No big deal. All right, let's see what we got. We got a Josh Allen pink prism. That's not too bad. I like that. That was a dope. Okay, got a Keenan Allen. And we got a Nick Chubba Wubba. That's not too bad. Not too bad. Let's go ahead Put that right there. We got a Ramondre Stevenson green prism there. Go ahead and put these over here. And how the heck y'all been, man? Like I said, it's been a minute. You know, it's been a minute. Spring for us over here in uh, the upper Midwest. I mean, it was, what is it? June 12th, June 13th, I don't, I don't even know, and it's, a, you know, it was, it was probably like high 50s right now, that's weird, it's summertime, I mean, I, I like, I'm a, cold, I'm a creature of the cold weather, so I like cold weather, but it's, it's too cold for this time of year, but it's okay, we're going to pay for it, it's about to be 100 degrees in a couple days, Okay, we got a rookie over here. I like the color, but let's see what we got here. Ah, uh, of course. <laughs> Nick Guan. I've seen him in a lot of those dusty boxes of uh, Hobby for um, for Prism. Man, my heart hurts for them, bro. Everybody, well, you know, yeah. Oh, yeah. My heart hurts for everybody that, you know, invested all that money just to pull that. I mean, <sighs> high risk. High reward, I guess. I mean, like I said, uh, when, like I heard, I think it was Pac-Man that said it. You know, you know, high risk, high reward. You know, when you hit, you hit big, but when you don't, you lose big. And I remember him saying that. I was like, damn, man, not amen. So, I mean, I just I wasn't in the position to go ahead and risk it like that. I got Jimmy G, Amra St. Brown, and Thomas Davis Jr. Got some rookies in here. It's not too bad, not too bad. Okay, we got one more of the Mosaic Bonus Pink Parallel Pack. Pink Prism. Pink, uh, pink Mosaic. There you go. You know what I mean. Okay, we got a, a Brian Lacker from The Bears. The GOAT himself, Ryan Fitzpatrick, who, who recently retired, and I did not know. In all his years and all those teams he he was with, he didn't make the playoffs not once. Damn, that sucks. Kirk Cousins, so no big rookies. He's cool. It's cool. And now on to the main event, the showstoppers, the cellos. Uh, what's been working for a lot for a lot a lot of people a lot of people have been getting high hit high hits uh, been yielding high hit rates there you go so let's see if we can be a part of the cool kids y'all right, Kim Hicks Larry Johnson Mark Lawrence Rodney Harrison Deshaun Watson. <laughs> okay. Uh, NFL debut with Trey Lance. Okay. 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 Just wait a little bit. We're good. We're good. Got a green. And Rogers. Who's dating a witch now, I heard. That's pretty interesting, right? And got his boy. His, his. They're they boys still, man. They're still boys. Devontae Adams, Russell Wilson, Greg Newsom, Justin Fields, true rookie. Okay, okay, okay. I'm not mad at it. I'm not mad at it. Heck no, I'm not. This is a $15 pack. 
So if he can do any kind of magic, I mean, and just hold his value, he'll be straight. Just because I want to see him. Pink, okay, okay, base, blue, fluorescent. I'm just looking at the variation. I never looked at these, the variation part of here. That's cool, that's cool. All right. Anything over like there? Jarvis Landry, Buddha Baker, Taysom Hill, Terry McLaurin, Cleus Campbell, Patrick Mahomes. Again, there ain't no color to it, right? There ain't no color to it. But I'm gonna take this as a W right now because something tells me come prison season. When the prison retail hits, this hitting any of the, hitting, hitting any of the rookies worthwhile are going to be few and far between. So I'm gonna I'm gonna take that as a, a big W. <laughs> Darren Waller, Hall of Fame Barry Sanders, somebody Mike Strachan. Strachan? I mean, it's from my close, but I I just don't remember him. Makes me a bad fan, and I apologize for that. And then somebody from the Bucks, I don't know who it is. We're gonna put them over here with the rest of the rooks. Got two more of these fellows. Okay, a little peeksy there. All right, got a David Montgomery, Patty Mahomes, Denzel Mims, Stafford. There we go, another another rookie. Worthwhile there. Got an NFL debut with Zach Wilson. Kyler Murray. Joe Montana. Devontae Parker, the Green Prism, Green Mosaic. Got game. Derek Carr. The prism of Hall of Fame, Chris Martin. Got a Josh Palmer from the Chargers. And Trey McKitty, also from the Chargers. Cool, cool, cool. Last pack. Last pack. Let's see what we can get, y'all. Come on now. All right. Jerry Judy, Josh Allen, Leonard Fournette. Michael Thomas, Joe Sherbert, Aaron Jones, Joe Burrow, my boy Peyton Manning, the sheriff, the forehead, whatever y'all want to call him. I believe Ryan Fitzpatrick called him the goal, right? Call him the, he's the, the best quarterback. Tom Brady is the, the, the best champion or something like that. I'm not going to argue with that. DK Metcalf. We got a prism of Hall of Fame Ray Lewis. Finish off with a Chaz Sherratt and a Taiwan Wallace. So nothing, excuse me, nothing too crazy. And again, it wasn't really about it. If we can get lucky for the one time, for the one time, that would have been excellent. But We were able to get some, I mean, it's not fuego, but it's a little spark, you know what I mean? We got a Trey Lance NFL debut, the true rookie Justin uh, Justin Fields, NFL debut of Zach Wilson, and an NFL debut of Justin Fields. And we've got some color, nothing crazy. I just wanted to come back, make a video for you guys, tell you what's been going on, you know, what's going to be coming into the hobby real soon. Um, just, you know, shoot the... Uh, the shiz with y'all 
let you know I missed y'all, man. I miss I miss doing this. I've been thinking about it. And, you know, when Prism hits, when Optic hits, because that's going to be next month. And, and Select, that's going to be next month, too. And next, next couple months. So there's going to be a lot of stuff out there. And, and God willing, I'll be able to get my hands on it and bring it to the channel. Hopefully we can catch some bangers, some heaters. Um, and, you know, ride the wave with y'all. Um, just like always, man, if y'all can do your homie a, a solid, hit that like button. If you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe. Hit the bell icon. And we're going to... We, we, hopefully we can make it to 50 right now i believe we're at like 33 subscribers and and i appreciate every single one of y'all uh freaking you know next milestone is 50 uh i'd greatly greatly appreciate it um yeah until next time you, you know my name is Gibson, you've been to the mix with me and and until next time adios peace cuidate